The Yanks have a much longer history of it. Beg your pardon? I'm sorry, I meant to say the Brits. I just almost puked in my own just mouth. What is the rest of science? Why should people listen to it? You're already not listening to it. How's your life going? <laughs> exactly, it wouldn't hurt. What is the most vegetable vegetable? Turnip. Turnip. I think that's a pretty good one. I mean, yeah, it feels like the most vegetable vegetable should be a vegetable right out of central cast. For me, it's gonna be like broccolis and carrots. Well, okay, but carrots are like genetically engineered to be orange and fancy. But a turnip, it's just got nothing else. Nothing. Just vegetable, that's all it connotes. Who is better at science, the UK or the US? I'm gonna do the cop-out answer, which is that we need both together. The Yanks have a much longer history of it. Beg your pardon? I'm sorry, I meant to say the Brits. <laughs> yeah, sorry. that makes no sense. I just, I just almost puked in my own just mouth. Kidding. I'll take that answer, even though we all know the answer is the UK. Carry on. What's the point of crying? There's lots of different theories about this. Well, I quite like this idea that demonstrating your vulnerability means that you're more likely to get people on your side. Because the whole hormones are released and you feel better doesn't explain why we don't see emotional crying from other animals. What conspiracy theory do you think I secretly believe in? I've always thought that you don't believe that the year 300 to 600 ever happened. <laughs> you strike me as the kind of person who's one of those historical skeptics. A denier. Where you're like, has it really been 2,000 years since year zero? It feels like it's been maybe 1,700 most. Yeah, I mean, it is a bit suspicious. Can you name it. something that happened between nope. 300 and 600? Oh, let's just call it the Dark Ages and be done with it. See, there you go. Is water wet? I've got a very strong opinion about this. I believe that to be wet means that the intermolecular forces of a water molecule are stuck to you or stuck to something. Mm. And so a single water molecule all by itself not wet at all. Two? But two together? Oh yeah, oh yeah. They want to touch. They, they've wet each other. They're mutually wetted. How often do you find a single water molecule floating around on its own? Honestly, mm. too often. Okay. I'm sick of it.